Ever wondered how money grows over time and how it can work for you? This is where understanding financial mathematics comes in. First, let's talk about compound interest. You know, the kind that has been called the eighth wonder of the world. This is the interest you earn not only on your initial investment or principal, but also on the interest that your money has already earned. Think of it as a snowball rolling down a hill, gathering more snow as it goes along. That's your money growing faster and faster. The key factors here are the rate of interest and the frequency of compounding. A higher interest rate or more frequent compounding can lead to much larger growth. Now that we've got a handle on compound interest, let's dive into annuities. These are not your everyday financial products, but they can be a powerful tool in your financial arsenal. There are three main types, fixed, variable, and indexed. Fixed annuities provide a guaranteed income stream while variable annuities offer a potential for growth linked to the performance of investment portfolios. Indexed annuities, on the other hand, offer a blend of guaranteed returns and potential market-linked growth. Why should you care about annuities? Well, they can be an essential part of your retirement planning strategy. Annuities can provide a steady income stream in retirement, helping to ensure that you don't outlive your savings. Understanding these concepts of financial mathematics, compound interest and annuities, can give you a significant edge when planning your financial future. They can help you grow your wealth, plan for retirement and navigate the financial world with confidence. With a solid grasp of financial mathematics, you're well on your way to making informed financial decisions. But remember, knowledge is power. Now that you've learned about financial mathematics, it's time to apply that knowledge to managing your everyday finances. First, let's delve into one of the most fundamental aspects of personal finance, budgeting. Picture a budget as your financial GPS, guiding you towards your financial goals. It's about understanding where your income goes, controlling your expenses, and ensuring you're saving enough. Now what makes a good budget? It's one that suits your needs, aligns with your financial goals and most importantly, it's one you can stick to. Remember, a budget isn't meant to restrict your spending, but to empower you to live within your means without sacrificing your lifestyle. Next, let's talk about tax independence. It's all about taking the reins of your tax situation. Whether you're a W-2 employee or a freelancer, understanding tax brackets, deductions and credits can be a game changer. For instance, did you know that tax deductions lower your taxable income, while tax credits reduce your tax bill dollar for dollar? Knowledge like this can help you handle your taxes confidently and potentially save you a lot of money in the process. By mastering these personal financial management skills, you're taking significant steps towards financial freedom. So keep learning, keep growing, and remember, your journey to financial success is a marathon, not a sprint. Having a handle on your day-to-day -day finances is crucial. But what about the future? That's where investing and building wealth come in. Imagine your money as an army of dollar bills, each working tirelessly to recruit more dollar bills to your cause. That's essentially what investing does. There's a world of investment vehicles out there, stocks, bonds, real estate, and more. Each comes with its own level of risk and potential return. Higher risks may yield higher returns, but they could also lead to greater losses. That's why understanding the balance between risk and return is paramount. Now, how do you secure your investments from the unpredictability of the market? You diversify. Think about it like not putting all your eggs in one basket. By spreading your investments across different asset classes, you reduce the risk of losing all your money if one investment doesn't pan out. But investing isn't just about playing the market, it's about setting clear financial goals and working towards them. It's about consistently contributing to retirement accounts like individual retirement accounts and 401 KAs. It's about considering strategies like dollar cost averaging, where you invest a fixed amount at regular intervals, regardless of the price of the investment. This disciplined approach can smooth out the highs and lows of market volatility. Investing is a marathon, not a sprint. With patience, consistency and the right knowledge, you're well on your way to building wealth and achieving financial success. We hope you found this guide to mastering financial skills helpful. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Your likes help us to reach more people and empower them with the financial knowledge they need to achieve their goals. If you want more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way you'll be the first to know when we drop new videos. Remember, your journey to financial success starts here. It's a long road but with the right knowledge, patience and consistency, 
you're well on your way. So, like subscribe and stay tuned for more practical guidance on personal finance, investing, and wealth building. Until then, keep investing in yourself.